Hi everyone, and today we will be dis discussing this parity checker. Okay, initially we will discuss even parity checker. In this video, we will give introduction about parity. Okay, parity checker in the sense is used to check whether the given in sent information through the transmission is correct or not. Suppose if you are sending any digital information, there may be some error while transmitting from one place to another place, right? So what will happen in uh, digital signals either zero can be converted into one or one can be converted into zero okay so in order to avoid this okay along with the transmission data the parity data that is also which is generated while uh, sending the transmission data is also sent with that information data in order to avoid this error right so the parity generating technique is one of the most widely used error detection technique okay so in this in digital system when binary data is transmitted and processed data may be subjected to noise such that noise can either alters zeros to ones or ones to zeros okay a parity bit is added or added along with the information bit which is transmitted from one place to another place to uh, a parity is added to the word containing data in order to make numbers of ones either even or odd suppose uh, in before sending the information with the parity generator what have what it does is it counts whether it has even number of ones or odd numbers of ones okay so that di data is also sent with the data so uh, transmission data so it's like sending a parcel uh, lots of parcel and counting that I am sending that whether it has odd number of parcels or even numbers of parcels right so that's like that so the message containing the data bits along with the parity bit is transmitted from transmitter to the receiver so this is what happens okay so here we have the even parity generator okay initially we will uh, look for the generator then we will go for checker initially I will be discussing even parity generator only then we will discuss for uh, odd parity generator okay so even parity generator what happens is if you have even even number of ones there then you will be having zero in the parity generator okay so check here if we have even number of ones we have zero ones here that is no ones is present here so you will be having zero if you have only one one you will be having one and here also only one is here that is one is here here you can check there are two ones so the parity generator creates zero as a parity bit and similarly for this one and similarly for this one okay so this is what the parity generator for a three bit message looks like you can design it for a two bit message this is a simple easy XOR gate but if you go for three bit uh, parity generator three bit message and uh, its corresponding parity generator here we have this okay a b and c are inputs which is already shown in the, as a message and the output generated with the help of two xor gates are nothing but the parity bit okay these four bits are transit transmitted from one place to another place through the transmitter and it is received by the receiver in order to avoid the error while uh, error occur during the communication okay this is what the idea of the parity is. okay so we will discuss or we will design the tinkercad circuit in the upcoming video